Tonight in Medical Rounds, each week there are 200 Americans diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. It's a startling number, but there is a program at Hartford Healthcare, I should say, that is offering patients some new options. And we're joined by Dr. Brian Wong. He specializes in something called neuroimmunology, and he is launching this new program at the Iyer Neuroscience Institute at Hartford Healthcare. Good evening, Dr. Wong. Thanks for being with us tonight. Good evening. Well, first tell us, what is neuroimmunology? Neuroimmunology is a subspecialty within neurology which focuses on the immune system's role in contributing to neurologic diseases. This includes relatively common conditions such as multiple sclerosis as well as less common conditions like neuromyelitis optica or neurosarcoidosis. All right, well tell us about the program that you've created at Hartford HealthCare. This is a new program for us here at Hartford HealthCare, which I'm really excited about. Um, our, the Neuroimmunology program is a dedicated program for conditions like multiple sclerosis, where our goal is to first diagnose patients with these conditions in our clinic in Southington, and subsequently, once they've been diagnosed, provide them with new cutting-edge treatments, including some of the newer infusion therapies, to minimize the effect that conditions like multiple sclerosis have on our patients' lives. Oh, you got my attention with the newer treatments. What type of treatments will be offered, the new technologies, the infusion therapy you talked about? There are currently 15 different medications available for the treatment of multiple sclerosis. The medications help to prevent episodes of acute worsening, often called relapses, and consequently prevent long-term disability. Um, we're seeing some really positive outcomes with these medications, and as a result, it's really important to choose the appropriate medication for each individual patient. All right, that sounds great. Now, what do you want patients to know about MS and this new program? It's a really exciting time in the field of neurology. We have tools available to us for patients that we didn't, simply didn't have in years past, and as a result, we're seeing some remarkable outcomes that we couldn't achieve before. Wow, I love your optimism. Thank you so much, Dr. Wong, for sharing this important and valuable information for our viewers tonight.